What's going on guys? In today's video, I'll be showing you how I went from silver to platinum in less than a month. Now, before we get into this video, I would love to ask if you can hit that like button just so that you can get to more people. But anyway, let's not waste no time and get into this video. Now, the first step I can give you is basically aim training. Now, a lot of people practice on aim labs, some practice in the practice range and some practice, I don't know where, but they practice. Now, the best step I can give you is play death matches because death matches is basically going to train your game sense it's going to train everything your aim especially and game sense is the most important thing so it's going to practice that all in a whole so i would suggest playing at least two death matches or about 60 minutes of death matches every day and that should basically get you prepared for your competitive matches now for the second tip that i can give you is be confident but also be patient because so many people they have the confidence to basically just push the whole team and think that they're going to get all their kills no, no, no. You need to be patient when playing your matches because being patient is basically being smart in Valorant. Because confidence is going to give you that, you know, that drive to basically get that kill so that you don't play scared because that's the most thing. You don't want to be playing scared, but you also want to play patient. So don't rush a team. No one tip that I can give you, and this is a very valuable tip, and this is basically to be predictable. Now, what I mean by predictable is you, you basically want to play the whole Valorant match through your head. So you want to predict things. For example, you want to predict this team is basically going to plant A and then they're gonna plant the bomb where you wanted to be planted then you're basically gonna find a way to attack or if you're defending you want to find a way to defend because you basically want to play the you basically want to play the whole game through your head and that's a good tip now this tip is not for low ranks these are tips are for higher ranks for example and those players are basically a lot predictable because you need to be predictable so being predictable is a very good tip for example knowing what's gonna happen and just like thinking the game through and playing it through your brain so that you have a plan every game plan for every round for example and also another thing that you can do is basically switch up your game plan if you do this then basically do the next and it's almost like the saying don't let people know your next move but yeah the, all you need to do is basically just be predictable and coming to the third tip that is actually very important is play as a team now playing as a team is the most important thing if you watch any pro player any pro player they are playing as a team why are they playing as a team because this is the most important thing that they use and that is called communication now communication is the most important thing every pro player needs to communicate with a team for example if you basically see someone at a site you want to call it out if you shoot a jet or a rain or anyone on the team and you shoot them to 60 you want to basically tell the team because i see so many people not telling the teammates that they shot a jet or anyone on the team so once you shoot a jet and you see they're on 60 you basically want to call it out to your team and and tell your team so that your team know now coming to the fourth step and this is called positioning and repositioning now positioning is actually important because if you have stupid and silly positioning you're definitely gonna die like i swear you're gonna die so what you want to do with positioning is basically want to put yourself in a position that you have the advantage to kill someone for example not running out of corners and just swinging every angle badly no 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 you want to practice your positioning so that you have the advantage always stay undercover and always like be undercover so that when you shoot a person then it's time to think about the repositioning then you want to basically repositioning so these are basically the two and this are called being smart so you basically want to definitely implement that into your games position and repositioning now coming to the fifth tip that i can give you is the most important tip of all and that is called being consistent now i know i'm not even consistent but if you want to be consistent and you want to be a pro player you need to be consistent for example if i train one month and play again valorant next year i'm never going to be consistent so so this <laughs> anyway if you found this video helpful please give it a like or subscribe to the channel for more tips and tricks just like this but anyway i'm out